Holy dear God. Okay, this is the first video we we're filming in 2022. It is. You're right. That's it. That's all I got for you. This is the first video I've filmed up for any YouTube in 2022. <laughs> really? Yeah, I haven't right, filmed well, any other videos. Well, Happy New Year, Justin. Happy New Year. Okay, today we're doing Lucky Dog, and they are one of my favorite hot sauce makers. And I'm not going to lie, I've had these sauces for a minute. And I don't know why I've, it's taken me so long to get to these, but um, they all three of them sound delicious. It's because 2022 is the year of the dog. Is it? I just made that up. I was going to say, that would have <laughs> been like weirdly... Just, it may very well could be, I have no I idea what it is. That would be... That would have been... If you just pulled that out, that would have been great. Okay. Three sauces, a cherry, how good does he sound? Cherry Chipotle hot sauce, this is a Fuego Box exclusive. I don't even know if it's still in the Fuego Box, or but yeah, I've had these sauces for a minute. Um, heats a peach, and the, okay, he sent a note with it, and the only reason, I mean, I, this does sound delicious, but I'm more intrigued because he says, he says, you're gonna hate the heat rating on this, and it says LMAO. Here we so, go. Why am I gonna hate the heat rating? for a wild ride. I know, I don't know. Is he trying to say it's too mild? Is he trying to say it's like hilariously hot? I don't know, because it says that it's, it said it says super. Where is it? Extra hot. Extra hot. How extra hot? That's subjective, though. Exactly, it really is. And then a sweet and garlicky, gar, a sweet and garlicky roasted pepper sauce. That sounds perfect. Doesn't that sound great? I've never had a sauce described as sweet and garlic. Sweet garlic. I don't think I've ever. So I'm super into that one. Okay, a medium sauce, a medium sauce. An extra hot sauce. This is clearly going to be the last one. All right, this one's a little bit more medium, and this one's a little bit hotter. Okay, so we're gonna start with the sweet and garlicky. Gar I cannot say garlicky. Good. That is a hard word. Is to garlicky say. a word? I think it is. That is a hard word to say, though. Garlicky? For me, it's garlicky. Tough. I can't get it out. I bet if I say it like six times, it would get a little frustrating. <sighs> I don't know if this is original hot sauce, but it says it's right. It's an original. This is the original recipe. I don't know. If it's, I, I don't. I know nothing. Holy dear God! A lot of information here. Um, okay. This award-winning sauce is Lucky Dog's first commercial product and remains the most versatile in the product line. Sweetened with carrot juice and agave, this sublimely balanced, fire-roasted and fresh pepper sauce also features fresh and roasted garlic. Perfect for every garlic lover. Are you you're a garlic I'm guy? a garlic lover. I am a garlic man. Yeah. I love garlic. I eat an obnoxious amount of garlic cheddar popcorn this weekend. Did you? Yeah. I did not. I did. Obnoxious amount. Andy broke the spoon. I'm only forcing him to break, to to eat off the broken spoon. You get um, you get a metal spoon this week. I want to know if what's funny about this spoon? This was actually from my house. And it I really? Left it here. <laughs> yeah. That's why. <what> I, <laughs> I was, I was gonna was say fun. like I was gonna say I got you the fanciest looking spoon. This was from my house and I left it here. Oh, I, I you can take it home. I don't. We have a new set. Cider vinegar, <laughs> onion, roasted jalapenos, water, roasted garlic, carrot juice, chili peppers. What kind of chili peppers? Sea salt, carrots, cayenne pepper, agave, garlic, two kinds of garlic, I guess, lime juice concentrate. Sounds like a very well balanced sauce. It does. Um, I've never seen carrot juice as an ingredient, I don't believe. I've seen carrots. Car carrot, yeah, but that's but not, usually used as like a thickener almost, it seems like. Kind of. Um, I was honestly a kind of a hater on carrots and sauces until recently a certain person proved me wrong. Who was it? I can't tell you, but there'll be more people. You, 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 ah, we will learn later this year. It smells incredible. Oh my god, it smells so good. It better be sweet. I want some sweetness. The first word in the name of the sauce is sweet. What was? What's the sweet ingredient for it, though? I don't know. Roasted garlic, carrot juice, chili pepper, sea salt, carrots. Well, there's carrots in here, too. Carrots and carrot juice. I mean, carrots. That's the sweetness. The sweetest thing in it is a carrot. Oh, agave. Oh, yeah. Dude, it better be sweet. Um, I'm gonna say it's a it's uh, I think it's a medium loose. to th it's a medium medium body sauce. I was gonna say medium to. Thin. I don't know if mine's settled. Ours looks different. It does. Yours is a little bit thinner. Mine's yeah. a little bit thicker. You got a little bit of the, the the neck juice. Yeah. All right. Cheers, man. Let's see what happens. It's incredible. Oh my god. I get the uh, the lime juice or whatever. But it's lime. <laughs> I don't get the lime. I got lime juice. I didn't get it. Let me try. Some garlic. I got a lot of garlic though. <clears throat> it's got a little quick kick to it. Yeah, just like, but quick. It is extremely quick. It just caught me off guard. Because they got jalapeno. That is really good. It is really good. They got jalapenos and uh, cayenne that they're telling us about. And, and then they then got chili pep. And they got chili peppers. Which yeah. it, they're not. It's not scotch bonds or habaneros. I'll tell you that right now. No, it doesn't feel like it's that. It's not at a all. super hot. That's good. That is so tasty. That on oh, like pork, real quick. Double hit of garlic is great. 
I'm, I'm, you getting the lime? I got a, a little bit of lime. Yeah, I, like I, that I citrusy. Like, I get, I get the vinegar. Like the was it red wine vinegar? that I said, or the um, Sutter vinegar? Yeah, I'm getting. I get the vinegar. I get the tang. Um, it's it is sweet. It's it, but it's but not it's like, like a, sub, the, a subtle sweet. It's a very subtle. Yeah, it's not very like, subtle sweet. It's not like very sweet. good though. Well done. It's not like sweet tea sweet. You know, like sweet no. tea versus like a black tea. It's not, it's, like not a, like, it's not like a fruit sauce either. Like, no, it's not that kind of sweetness. It's like a it's a very subtle yep. sweetness. It's like the way that like um like molasses would bring. It's not that flavor, but no. like the way molasses would bring sweetness instead of brown sugar. Yep, like that. That shape of sweetness. Enough to let you know it's there. Just enough, just a tad. Um, incredibly garlicky, um, but like it's got the roasted garlic flavors. Not yep. like sharp garlic, yep. roasted, muted, delicious. Yep. You know, like it, the it works with the chipotle. I mean, like you know, like smashed garlic on toast, like that kind of garlic. Mm. That's really good. That is quite tasty. Um, this is a utility sauce. This is going to go on everything. Yep. Um, I can see this on breakfast sandwiches, you know, like yep. some eggs and cheese going on here, a little bit of bacon. Mmm, so good. Oh, yeah, you said pork? Put on pork, yeah. Put this on anything. Yeah, like, yeah. That's Utility a good one. sauce. That one's gonna be gone immediately. Okay, moving on. I got a lot to stand up. Yes, yeah, a lot to stand up to. That was a, that's gonna be hard to beat. Cherry chipotle hot sauce. So it better be cherries and chipotle. Like tartness. I like the I like the um, the wraps. I like the gold wraps. I hope there's some tart cherry. Prestigious look. You know, like I I, I like dark fruit. You know, like yeah. cherries got that dark. I hope I really hope it's there. Okay. I like the flavor of cherry. I don't like eating cherries. I love cherries. I don't like cherries. White label, a Fuego box exclusive featuring the rich savory flavor of Mecco chipotles with a subtle note of cherry. Just a hint of ghost pepper brings a slight glow of creeping heat while maintaining a medium profile that pairs beautifully with food. Hmm. All right. I, I hope I, I really want to taste the cherry. Water, apple cider vinegar, onion, mecco, chipotle pepper. I don't know what that is. Cherry concentrate. I kind of like that it's concentrated. Agave syrup, smart. Lime juice, sea salt, granulated garlic. Love it. Powdered onion and spices. I do like how there's like versatility in the ingredients. It's not like yeah. this is what I use and I'm going to like, this is my base and now I'm going to I'm going to change two ingredients to, to make change a new my sauce. sauce. Yeah. Like he's... Like the ingredients are different from sauce to sauce, at yeah. least in these two. Yeah, so I appreciate that. I'm excited for the uh, the cherry garlic mix. I know, right? Garlic's an odd one. Yeah, not to say it won't work. Beautiful, beautiful sauce. It is. Oh, uh, medium bodied. I love sausages. Just pour. It's easy. This is, this is a like, the perfect that, texture. As I say that, I can't get it out of the bottle immediately. Come on, get going. There we go. It smells like uh, like smoked. Yeah, that's a, that chipotle. Yeah, smoked. Yeah, it smells very smoky. Beautiful. So we're definitely gonna get the chipotle. I just we'll see if the cherry comes through. Yep. Cheers. There is a um. There is a texture to the sauce. There is. Like a granulatedness to it. Yeah. I'm not saying it's a bad thing. It's like the way that you get like like you know like chipotle's an adobo. Like if you buy like a can like canned chipotle's like that kind of texture. That's what I'm getting here. Dude, where's the cherry? Come on. I know. I was like really hunting for it. It's so subtle, but I can really concentrate it on it. It's there. Really concentrate. I get the, the smoked chipotles. I get a lot of chipotle. I'm I'm really hunting for that that tartness though. I didn't. I'm I not, wasn't noticing. I'm not it. getting the tartness, but I am getting this. It's so slight, but I'm also getting the garlic. Garlic, yep. Like it's so slight, like I get more garlic than I do that cherry. Like the cherry is interacting with the spice blend in a way that's making it its own thing. Like yep. it'd be nice to be able to try this sauce like with cherry and without cherry to see what it brings. Yeah. Because it's, I wish I, it's, I, I'm not saying, it, it, so it is delayed, it is so good. Yeah, there, it's, I'm mean, just it's being as critical as humanly possible on this. Like it is a great chipotle sauce. Yeah. Um, okay, the heat scale on the first one, what would you say is a one? Yeah. I'm gonna say, what would you say on this one is? Probably similar. I say it's a two, ish. Yeah. I mean, I might have had a little bit of residual from that earlier punch, but I mean, I do have a little bit of mouth heat right now, so two. Yeah, one then a two. So hold on, hold on here. So remember, the ingredients are water, apple cider vinegar, onion, mecco, chip chipotle peppers, cherry concentrate, agave syrup, lime juice, sea salt, gar uh, granulated garlic, powdered onion, and spices. What's the problem here? 
is when you read the ingredient, when you read the description, it talked about a ghost said, pepper. Yeah, just a hint of ghost pepper brings a slight glow of creeping heat. The very last ingredient is spices. So it might be like a blend. So it's like a blend. There's a tiny bit a spice blend. Tiny, tiny bit of ghost pepper in that tiny. Because I'm getting ever so slightly. Like yeah. the presence of a hotter pepper. Yeah, it's definitely like it's got like my t the sides of my tongues a little bit more, a little bit in the throat. I'm getting top of tongue and tip of tongue, yep. and that's it's 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 it, it, it like I, I can kind of feel that burn, but it's nowhere near. But yep. I'm like the presence of something hotter is there. Yeah. Um, super well done. Super, super delicious. Sauce. Two um, incredible sauces. So, so good. I just I really wish that a little bit more cherry. More cherry coming through. <coughs> Again, that's just being so critical. Okay. Heats of peach. You're going to hate, with an underline, the heat rating. LMAO. What does that mean? This is a Trinidad Scorpion hot sauce with peaches and roasted garlic. Peaches and garlic. That is quite the combination. It is a combination. And the thing is, like, peach isn't my go-to for it. I'm not a huge peach guy. I mean, I love peaches. I couldn't tell you the last time I purchased one. It's an annoying fruit to eat, I want to say. Yeah. I, I love it. I don't I mean, mind them. I don't go for them, though. I mean, I would go for them. I just don't. I don't know why. I got really no explanation. Okay. Heats of Peach. Inspired by a small batch of some of a sauce created as a wedding gift, Heats of Peach features peaches and Trinidad scorpion peppers and adapts to virtu virtually any food. California peaches and pear juice enhance the sweetness of, um, of tea scorpion peppers. Uh, while roasted garlic, onions, and a balanced blend of spices combine beautifully to create a savory and very hot sauce. Very hot. Yeah, it's, I mean, we're talking, look at that. Look at that heat scale. It's got... He's busting out the all top. All the way to the top with a flame sticking out of the top of he it. He is busting out. And that is a, I believe, foil up there. So, I mean, not... Spare no expense. It's pretty cool that it was made as a wedding gift. I know, right? Like that's what it started as, and then he was that's like, cool. "I, I kind of like this, so I'm gonna." If I was a hot sauce, if I if I had a friend, well, I, I do have friends of hot sauce makers, but if I had if I had a if I brought a hot sauce maker to a wedding and they brought me a hot sauce made for made for the wedding for that, I would be. Hyped. You're the be you're the best man now. I would be hyped. You're the best man now. Like the number one ingredient, peaches. Number two ingredient, cider vinegar, carrots, water, roasted garlic, sea salt, granulated garlic, garlic, powdered onion. Trinidad scorpion peppers and pepper. So Trinidad scorpion peppers are the second to last. Second to last, and then a pepper. What is that? A pepper blend or just pepper? Just pepper. Okay. Okay. Though I see, I might. You might I, see the, the I might flakes see of pepper. Flakes of pepper in here. Did I, say, did I say garlic? Granulated garlic. You did. Okay. Um, I'm gonna make the claim that he says I'm gonna hate the heat rating because he's gonna say it's a lot more mild. It's probably lower than what. Scorpion was the second to last ingredient. Yeah. But he Loose. said very hot sauce. Loose. Did you underline it in this? Nope, but it says, and very hot. Very hot. This smells really good. Trinidad Scorpion hot sauce. This should be a scorpion pepper sauce with peaches. So you should be getting scorpion peppers. This should be the bam shabam to lead it off. I'll do a little bit more. But he's saying savory. Yeah, it smells savory. It smells very savory. Wow, that is Garlicky. Good. Yeah, garlicky. And the vinegar is poking out a little bit, too. Right. Yeah, you're right. Okay, cheers. Let's see what happens. Peaches. I actually taste the peaches on this one. I taste the peaches too. Rub them. <coughs> neck of it. Um, peaches and Savory. then yeah, then the the garlic and that vinegar comes through. Garlic, peaches, garlic. Um, it's good though. It's interesting. It's a weird. It is. This is a weird sauce. There's levels to it. There is. Yeah, it's complex. There's levels to weird it. Weird and complex. Um, it's really good though. I get this like odd citrusy garlic situation. Like, yeah, I get the, it's like a peach pear, like, like uh, ripe fruit, and then you get the garlic, and then eventually the scorpion pepper comes in. I'm getting that. I'm getting that scorpion sting. He says you're gonna hate with an underline. I'm gonna say remove the underline. You know, like it is. It, this is a hot sauce. It is hot sauce, and but he scored it the right way for, to, for us. Mm -hmm. It's not like we weren't going into it like, oh, this won't be that bad, and then it absolutely rocks us. It went the other way. Yeah, I mean, it's not like... Which I'm fine with that. It's not like obliteratingly hot. No. It's mm. But it's a, it's a really warm sauce, and it's burning like a scorpion pepper sauce. Is, I got yes. it everywhere. Yep. Side my tongue. My tongue is on fire. My tongue, my cheeks, top, throat, 
Yep. I feel whiskey chest. I get it burns just like a scorpion pepper. The whole everything, yep. the whole gamut of burning. Very stingy. Yep. Um, interesting one. Okay, so uh, heat level on this one. You ready? Yep. Three, two, one, three. It's a three. So we stepped up on yeah. each one. Um, this one, more direct <coughs> uses than the previous two sauces, I think. Think so? I would think so. Yeah. Like, like you just. You thinking more of like a table, like table sauce? No, no. I'm saying like you're finding what this one works with. Oh yes, I, compl like I completely a agree. A more direct sauce on yeah, this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Um, out of the three, which is your favorite? I don't know, man. That first one was really good. That second one was incredible, and I like that the third one too. I like them all. I do too. I don't know if I can pick a favorite. Obviously, that first one though was incredible. This first one, man, or this one, this first one, his sweet garlicky roasted pepper yeah. sauce. That is. The jam for it me, is. super good. Love it. Uh, I mean, this is a thing. I, I could, I'll probably, I could use the whole bottle on one meal. Yeah. Like, yeah. it's crushable. But garlic is the superior ingredient in most things. It's really good. So okay. In the description below is going to be a link to Lucky Dog, so you can check these sauces out. Um, also, is going to be a link to Justin. We're still trying to get him to ten thousand. I'm on growing. Instagram. I He's am growing. growing. I am He's growing. We're, we're we're doing good work. We're here, working. People. We're doing good work. Um, Regardless, I hope you enjoyed. See you guys in the next. Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, from now on, I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going to, oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.